Hi everyone, Fred Armijo, Chief of the Oceanside Police Department. Over the last few years, we have witnessed the rising popularity of electric bicycles, otherwise known as e-bikes. We want to ensure the safety of everyone on our roads. With so many new riders joining the phenomenon, it's important to talk about safety. To keep yourself and others safe when you ride, make sure to follow a few simple safety steps. Check your feet and equipment. Ride with closed toe shoes that fit properly and do not slip off easily. Conduct an equipment check before you start your ride. Be cautious when getting on and off your bike. Use mirrors just like you do when you are driving your car. Watch your speed and braking. You will need to train yourself to brake earlier than you would on a traditional bicycle. Know the laws. Anyone riding an e-bike must adhere to general safety tips and any laws that apply in the area. Remember to ride your bike like a vehicle. Follow the rules of the road to keep yourself and others safe while you enjoy your bike. When bike lanes are present, please use them. Riding on sidewalks, especially at speeds possible with e-bikes, can create greater risks for pedestrians. If bike lanes are not available, make sure to ride in the far right lane as close to the edge as practical. Ride at an appropriate speed for the area you're riding in. Please be sure to signal when turning and make deliberate eye contact with pedestrians and drivers if you will cross in front of them. Despite being a bicycle, having a motor on e-bikes makes them fall under many of the same regulations regarding motorized vehicles. Follow the rules of the road to keep yourself safe and legal when riding in traffic. The California Vehicle Code requires that all persons under 18 wear a helmet. There are three different classes of e-bikes. A class three is one capable of speeds up to 28 miles an hour, and all persons, regardless of age, riding this class must wear a helmet. However, regardless of the type of e-bike, all riders should wear a helmet, as doing so reduces the risk of head injury by 70%. Keep others aware of your presence. For added safety, always ride with a front and rear light, wear brightly colored clothing, and use reflective tape. Be ready to alert walkers or other bike riders via a horn, bell, or verbal means if you approach them from behind. They may not hear you or your bike. Signaling others of your presence also means you need to be aware of anyone coming behind you. Leave the headphones and earbuds at home. You will need to keep your ears open to be aware of others around you. Above all else, please be nice and ride friendly. Last but certainly not least, protect your investment. Make sure to secure your e-bike with a quality lock and when possible, store it in a garage. The Oceanside Police Department recovers hundreds of bikes a year, but we often have no way to determine who they belong to. We have partnered with Project 529, which offers a registration for your bike free of charge. By registering your bike, you'll help us identify and return the bike to you if it's ever found. Visit project529.com to register. By following the rules of the road and these simple safety steps, you can keep yourself, your bike, and others out of harm's way. Stay connected with the Oceanside Police Department on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube for additional safety tips and more. Please also remember to visit joinopd.net to learn about current career opportunities at the Oceanside Police Department. Thank you and be safe. You're watching KOCT Television in Oceanside.